Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is The Plaguehead, and welcome back to Spirit Fair. Now, yeah, this game didn't really get all that many uh, views, but there was still a lot of unique view people who came to my channel in order to see this l little gem of a game that slowly crept beyond everyone's radar. And despite the fact it really didn't get all that kind of popularity like the Team Fortress 2 videos, it's still something I want to record. It's something I like doing, playing, and I don't have that urge to play it like I did with so many other games beforehand that I just end up start playing them on my own time. I think it would be a great time to record this game as well as the games I'm already playing. Eh, what am I doing? Y'all are probably wanting to see the content already. Let's get on with the game. Now, uh, as I was saying, I will be recording a lot of the content that I was previously. It's been my first week since I've actually started getting serious. Hunt down some jelly- oh yeah, that's right, we were hunting down jellyfish. But it's been about one week since we've actually started getting serious with it. Not really. Uh, we still have a little ways to go before one week comes. About two days. Before the first week of my YouTube channel. Re not not really rebranding, but reopening. We'll begin. I've tried, I've tried, I've tried so many times to make this work, and now it's finally happening. And I could not be happier. Anyway, let's get started with the game, shall we? This game is beautiful. It's adorable. It's got that nice little atmosphere, and I'm gonna keep playing it. What are the oh Oh, there he is. Oh, wait, right. Hang on. <laughs> One second, I forgot. I have to get my controller so I can record without the clickety clack of my keyboard. Uh, I had to get my controller because it's a little bit. This game's a little bit more fun with it. So, let's see. We'll go here. And we'll. Well, then we'll head to the jellyfish. Honestly, this game. I, I don't even know what to fully say. Like, yeah, I've been saying it's cute. But, like, you know. There's a reason it is. It's just such a interesting little game. It's. That honestly, I don't really want to do too much other than just chill and chat with you guys. To all my brand new subscribers who just joined me recently, I welcome you. For this is the official time. No more like trying, getting lazy, and not recording or not editing. No, this is the full fledged attempt to become a YouTuber. And I'm not doing it. Oh, okay. I'm not doing it because I'm competitive. And I just want to have a little passion project. Sure, TF2 is fun, but if you're doing a passion project, do you want to keep it the same thing over and over and over again non-stop? No, you really don't. Oh. Oh, what the hell happened here? What happened here? Oh my. Whoa. Stella or Daft to leave the boat, it will stop. It will restart automatically once everyone is back on board. Aww. Stella. Ah, yes. I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, the boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your ever light being, well, light. Or some other technicality. Mm -hmm. That being said, I will allow p it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck under the stars. I suggest you go to sleep too. That little cozy in that cozy room atop your cabin. Mm -hmm. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go, and this ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and speaking of that, you know me. Waking up on time has never been my forte. Mm -hmm. 
You can ring that bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Mm -hmm. Have a good night. I uh, I know my voice acting is absolutely fucking terrible, but I mean, the last my, my attempt at Darkwood, I was so paranoid that I completely clammed up. That's not how you record. I want this to be special. I want this to be something that I make on my own time, consistently, that people can enjoy. Because, you know, <laughs> if y'all don't enjoy it, then you'll have no reason to subscribe. And I'm gonna be honest, when Darkwood only barely even got anything, I was so discouraged on the first day. I didn't want to do anything. I ended up nearly taking a full-on break. Actually, no, I think I did. While we're traveling to the next spot, let me go ahead and take a look to make sure to see if I did or not. Yeah, no. I I did take a break. For, I think it was about a day or so. I think it was about a day or so when for me to stop. And then I recorded this game. This game is quite literally beautiful, and I genuinely love it. It's such a fascinating game that, from what I was guessing, I really hope I was right. But, you know, if I'm not, whatever. Because even if I'm wrong, then that, that doesn't matter. Oh, fuck, shit, it's getting creepy. It's getting creepy. Yeah, it's F12. Cool. I was taking a screenshot for, but hopefully. Damn. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get glims that way. I will wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out here. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. All right, here we go, boys. Here they come. Ooh, big one. Glim. Wait, hold. Whoa, whoa. What the frick are, What are glims? What are what are glims? Where is uh? Im there is inventory. Uh, okay then. I guess I, I, something tells me they're a form of currency of some kind. I can't jump that high. Wait, wait, no, come back! Come back! No! No, give me your cleanse! Oh, that was cool. That was nice. Come on, get up there. Get up, get up. Yeah, there we go. Excellent. Was that it? I think that was. Nope, that's not all of them. There's still more. Gotta get them all, gotta get as many as I can. This works. <laughs> oh, no! Uh, I need to be a little bit more calm. This game is all about being calm, right? Calm and mellow. But, you know, that's... If you've seen my TFT bit, which you probably have, that's not me at all. What? No, 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 Oh, that was it. We got him. Oh, how many did we get? Now that I've hit the menu button again. Uh, eight. Is that good? Or is that bad? I honestly don't know. Okay. I'm really impressed. You rocked out there. Tumbling and diving like a shooting star. That's new. With, and without the slightest fear nor hesitation at that. You definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. Mm. And you even got enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently mm. waiting, slowly digesting myself. 
I don't know why I gave her kind of like a Gladys tone of voice, but that's just kind of what she sounds like to me. Maybe I'll do Portal one day. Yeah, maybe I will. Oh, that's a guest house. Uh, where's the kitchen? There it is. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. It looks like a little... Can I... Aww. Oh. Is this game, like, finicky like this? I really hope this game isn't finicky like that. But... We got a kitchen. She looks tired. Hey. She alright? Hey, what time is day is it? He said only do it at the right time. Is this the right time? Ding, ding, ding. It is! So, you have to wake them up every single day. That's kind of cute. Oh, she went back because she was tired. You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put any one ingredient into the oven and wait for it to be cooked. Mm -hmm. You could even try the, these loose corn kernels that I've been hanging around in my pocket. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. What? Why does she have three things of corn? Why would anybody have three things of corn on them at any one time? What is she, what is she doing with three pieces of corn? Uh, anyway, let's get back to being a little bit more cool. I can smell it. I can eat anything. Just give me some food. Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I thought it could be. Would be. Aww. This game is so freaking wholesome. I love it. But then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. We need a good meal once in a while. It'll be up to you to understand who's fond of what. Oh no, it's terrible. As for me, I'm sure you remember I've always loved comfort food. And that I would die for a cup of coffee. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Mm. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I get, there is something I was supposed to give you. I'm not exactly sure how it works. But an obol is a symbol of passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay you. But something tells me you knew that already. Okay, let's keep improving this craft. As you've seen, in your blueprint table there is both a field and a garden blueprint. Which means you can grow many different things and turn this ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my opinion. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it around here. And you can grow linen in it, which in turn will be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to use it. But that will come later. You need to visit an island close by. It's called Mulstein Cove, and there's something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. Oh, cool. So we got, like, an actual form of currency. There's actually a form of currency in this game. She said we need to go to Mustang Cove. Let's see, look at what we got. We got popcorn, we got turnips, herrings, empty shell, common muscle. Ooh, okay, I see. So we can grow our own food, as she was saying. Wait. What are the logs used for? Do I even know what the logs are used for? Do I have any, like, building? I do, so it is for the kitchen. Perfect place to nurture your veggie seeds into healthy green with a little bit of water and carry your cereal seeds will grow into a plant in no time. A guest house, everyone's welcome to the guest house. Fascin this game is fascinating sometimes. It really just is so fascinatingly cartoonish. And it's so relaxing. Honestly, if I wasn't trying to keep a time limit, I probably would lose myself in this game. Unfortunately, we're only able to do one action per like 30 minutes because of how slow the game is. Which isn't a bad thing, you know? It's fine. It's fun to take the slow route. 
And after all, this is my... Oh, here we go. Cutscene time. Cutscene time? Cutscene time! Mostine Cove discovered. Look at that! Mm -hmm. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Alright, so, I'll do this before it's time to call it in. Wait, no. Wait, no, 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 that's something right. No, this is only about... How long have I been recording? <laughs> only 16 minutes, so I've got another good chunk. Yeah, no. <laughs> I was thinking, I was, I was thinking the wrong way. I wasn't thinking straight, my guys. I'm sorry about that. Here we go. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine. I promise. Mm. It's the best way to get the wood you need, actually. But don't worry. It'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. Hmm. I guess that explains why we can only cut down a limited amount of trees, you know? Uh, oh! Wait, can I... Okay, so you can actually use the D-pad. Which I don't like. For you have become death, the destroyer of worlds. Jokes aside, that's how you do it. So you go on ahead, cutting down more trees, we can, then we can go back to the boat and build the field with all of those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Ooh. Ooh. That brings up a good question. Uh, oh, I see. Okay. So, what? Do I have to... Oh, I think I get it. Yeah, I get it. You have to wait for the right moment. Oh, there's not an elf here. There's nothing else here. There's nothing else here. So, two trees and a rock. Oh, and some bushes, dude. That, that's all. Two, bu two bushes, two bushes, two trees, and uh, a little something else for the, for the road, you know? Anyway. Anyway. said that we can build a garden, so can we do it yet? We can. Oh no. It, is it gonna, not going to be big enough? I think we're just going to barely have any room for it. That's, that's not good. Oh. 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 Uh, okay then. <laughs> You can legitimately move stuff around. Wait, so edit. Cool. I probably shouldn't be playing a game with so much, like, to require talking. Oh my gosh! <laughs> That's so cute! But you can pet the kitty. Wait, hold up. Oh. <laughs> I keep petting the kittens. <laughs> what? Ha oh, oh. She stands on. She like stands on the Everlight. That's adorable. Mm -hmm. Ha! It's looking better than I thought. There's a little. Jenny Swakoi to it. Huh? Simple but elegant. Mm -hmm. Now all you have to do is plant the field seeds in there. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't mm. bother trying. 
But you know me, I would kill for a plastic cactus. But don't take my word on this. Anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes in seeds. Mm -hmm. He set up a shop in Hummingbird, the busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brothers are all founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Yes, this world has a serious problem of dubious business practices. Mm -hmm. Since I don't want to get swindled, oh, since I don't want to get you swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once, and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingbird, then. We just need to find some seeds for that field. Wait, but I... do I have any? I have some! Well, I have three. <laughs> This game is like legitimately putting a smile on my face right now. <laughs> like, I'm genuinely happy. I, I might do some like fishing on my own time just to like rack up the amount of food that I have. But like I think you guys should see most of the journey. Like, you know. If I have to go back and I have to grind jellyfish or I'm like just going through everything trying to get every trying to get all the resources from an from a destination from a place we've already visited. I'll skip it. Just for you guys. Don't worry. I got your back. So, we can go to Hummingbird, or we can go get those crates. I think... Hmm. A tricky dilemma. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do first? What do we do first? Uh... Let's go get those crates. Let's go get the crates. Oh, and it's it's almost nighttime. Let's do one quick fishing trip. Honestly, I really hope you guys start enjoying this game, at least a little bit. Because if you guys enjoy the game, then it'll it'll inspire me. <laughs> I guess that's the word. It'll make me really want to continue making this. Because to be honest with you, once Darkwood dropped, I I felt empty. I I know I already said this, but I'm just. I'm sorry for trying to guilt trip you guys, but motivation is a serious thing, you know. If you don't, if you ain't got the drive to do a certain game or a certain series, or even just to draw or to write or anything that you really feel passionate about, it hurts. You feel kind of empty inside. I hate that. I genuinely hate that feeling, and that's why I'm so happy to see. Uh, people are subscribing, the videos I'm putting out are getting watched. And I checked the analytics as I'm a huge, I don't know why, but just something about doing YouTube is genuinely making me look at analytics and go, that's me. I can, I'm doing that. And just a smile plasters on my face. And I'm just so happy to be able to know that there's a, not only just a lot of people finding my content, but a lot of people who are genuinely deciding to stay. <laughs> we got there at the perfect time. Uh, let's keep... Unfortunately, we can't really do that, so let's go to bed. attack. <laughs> Nervous chuckling as I am practicing. And good morning. Now that we're back in action, it's early morning. Let's take a look around. See, uh, did we miss a little glowy sparkle bit? I think we missed the glowy sparkles. 
I think I missed the glowy sparkles. I missed the glowy sparkles. Ah, oh, how could I miss the glowy sparkles? Unless it's not on every single one of them. Calm down with that bell. When you ring it at night, people will get up. No one likes, nobody likes to be woken up, especially me. Oh, right. We're not going, we're not building something new. We're heading to Hummingbird. I've met Albert already. He's definitely a shock. But his interest in all things maritime will be mm -hmm. helpful. Such as long or such as the boat upgrades he sells at an outrageously high price. With those you'll be able to cross the ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like classic classic mythical challenges mm -hmm. again. A bit cliche if you ask me. Hug. Hug! Oh, feeling much better. Oh, you can't hug her multiple times a day. Let's see, she didn't want to eat the same thing. Oh, oh, oh. I've already, I already did that. I don't need to do that again. Wrong buttons, wrong buttons. Let's see, what can we cook? What can we cook? Uh, we're getting oval. What? Why does a single batch of berries take way more than just white? Oh, we're are we already there? We're already there. That was fast. Stella, hmm. you know, I'm delighted that you're here with me. But I'm not surprised one bit. It adds hmm. up. You here, taking care of me in my final hours. You always cared so damn much about others. Hmm. I always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pendatic snob oh, even pendatic snobs like me. Remember the day my father yelled at the cat? Mm -hmm. We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Mm -hmm. Father turned red and he smashed the purple Delano vase. It was rad. It was rad? Yeah, my father just destroyed part of the house. It was rad. Well, with that, I think we are about out of time. It has been a great time recording this game again. I know that last time it did not go so well on in the terms of views, but I promise to add more tag. I promise to... No, 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 no. I promise to continue making this for the people who do want to watch it. For the people who want to watch me just kind of chat. This game is going to be my chill. My converse with you guys and just share a little bit about myself. And maybe even entertain you guys with my story, with anything that might come up. Real quick, let me take a look. Anyway, my name is The Plague Head. And when we return, we will be going into Hummingbird in order to get some seeds for our farm. With that, I bid you all farewell. Thank you. Thank uh, thanks for watching.